हेलो एवरी वन आई होप यू आर डूइंग गुड एंड रीडिंग ऑसम बुक्स सो दिस वीडियो इज नॉट अबाउट बुक रिकमेंडेशन दिस वीडियो इज अबाउट हाउ टू लर्न इंग्लिश हाउ टू स्पीक इन इंग्लिश सो मोस्ट ऑफ द गाइड्स डोंट नो वेयर टू स्टार्ट वट टू लुक अप टू वट आर दिस सिंपल स्टेप्स एंड टिप्स टू लर्न इंग्लिश सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शेयर विथ यू गाइज थ्री टिप्स दैट यू कैन लुक अप टू एंड यू कैन यूज टू स्पीक इन इंग्लिश विथ बेसिक इंग्लिश लाइक यू कैन कम्युनिकेट विथ सम वन इफेक्टिवली हु नोज इंग्लिश बेटर so that both of you can understand each other uh, very easily so in this video i'm going to share with you guys these three tips and also i have used it in the past and i am continuously using these three tips to learn english more and to uh, communicate very effectively in english and if you are on very beginner level basically you lack of confidence and you don't know what are the words to use what are the sentences you should use to have a effective conversation with someone so this video is specifically for you those who are very beginner level and and uh, i'm sure these three tips will be very helpful to you so uh, most of you guys also see like on my channel i make very simple english videos like very simple words not very complicated words so that everyone can understand it and i don't know very complicated words so i try to use uh, the words that i know to express myself whatever i wanted to say in those videos so i use very simple english words so let's just start with this video and uh, i will tell you guys those three tips that i've continuously using it and i'm also trying to improve with these three tips to have a effective conversation with someone first step would be read english books so it doesn't matter if you're reading a fiction book or a non fiction book uh, the thing is you have to read english book to understand like what are the author is trying to say so basically whenever you're reading a book you're also simultaneously making the images in your head you use imagination with those sentences with those paragraphs that you're reading so it doesn't matter if you're reading non fiction book or fiction book the thing is you simultaneously making uh, and you understand those english words in your head and you are also simultaneously doing it so basically in the later this this will be very helpful to you to you know for the next tip that i'm going to share in this video and uh, the thing is this is i've also used it personally when i used to read books from the first time like from past 7 or 6 six, six or 7 years ago when i started reading books and uh, this happening simultaneously with me and i've used it uh, uh, with this tip if you haven't read any book in the past and you wanted to learn english so start with With one and i am going to share with you guys some of the books that you can with simple english words like these books are very simple to understand and uh, this will be very helpful to you so i am going to uh, share with you guys in the description box below like four or five books so that you can start with these books and if you haven't read any yet so make sure you start with these books my second tip is think in english so start to think in english and this will be very effective to you if you do it the right way and uh, i try to think in english almost all of the time so whenever i wanted to speak something with someone or like whenever i'm sitting like very silently and i am try to think any ideas or i'm or i'm trying to think in any past event or any future thing i think in english so basically try to make words in english in your head before you speak anything so basically you can achieve this step very easily if you have complete the first step so if you have read any book in english and you have developed a habit of reading it every single day like 10 pages or 20 pages and you have develop a routine so this tip will be very easy for you because thinking in english and if you don't know any words or you don't have something to imagine or like you don't have any scenarios or you don't have any situation where you can think of something so this uh, will be very helpful if you have completed the first step so make sure you do it every single day try to think in english try to build a habit of thinking and using your thoughts using your imagination your ideas every thing in your head and uh, you know and basically if you have mastered it the first step the first uh, tip that i have said earlier basically reading a book and if you have mastered that so this thing will be very easy for you this you know you using those sentences using those words using those phrases uh, and building it try to uh, structure it in your head very perfectly and you will be master in it in just one month and i have also used it and uh, whenever i am thinking anything and try to uh, you know make those words make those stru structure it very carefully in my head before speaking anything and this is a very plus point for you if you you know use internet every day you have a smartphone and you are on the internet all of this media you consume like video format or text format audio format all of this uh, uh, content you consume all of this uh, are in english so basically this is the plus point we have uh, nowadays like everything on the internet every piece of content in english so we consume it like every single day and unconsciously these words these uh, stories that 
that we see on the internet all of these things goes in our head and we don't know like consciously so these are these informations are in english in our head already these are in our subconscious mind so when you try to like increase it so basically when you when you push yourself further and you try to use these tips and this will be very helpful to you and this is a plus point for you basically so in my case i created uh, this youtube channel to speak in english to boost my confidence so whenever i have any conversation with someone you know this conversation will be very effective for me if i know and if i build my confidence so this is very best medium for me so you know making this uh, youtube videos in english speaking in english and uh, every single day so this way i also practice myself this way i, I also correct myself i see my errors i see my mistakes and i'm trying to improve myself and if you want you can also do this you can also record yourself it doesn't matter if you wanted to post uh, you know anywhere or something else you just wanted to do for yourself you just wanted to improve yourself so that you can know uh, whenever you are making any mistakes any errors and you try to improve yourself so if you want you can also record yourself and you can also imagine yourself in front of the mirror you are speaking with someone else and this will also boost your confidence so my last tip would be watching movies and tv shows in english so in the past i used to watch a lot of them i used to watch movies and tv shows a lot of them like in many areas many different categories but whatever you know my favorite actor or my favorite director or cinematographer editor music director so i you know watch a lot of them in the past and nowadays i'm decreasing the watching time so basically nowadays i am watching very less and i think this is a very plus point for me whatever i have learned till now the english words or the phrases like anything the very big plus point is uh, i used to watch this english movies or this english tv shows so basically the point is you have to watch if you haven't watched any or you don't uh, have i know have a habit of watching in english and you all of the time watch this hindi movies and if you basically you, if you want to learn english you should watch this you are, or if you should start to watch this tv shows or movies in english and watch in subtitles and watch in subtitles so i used to watch in subtitles and nowadays if subtitles are there or you know not there I, it doesn't matter for me because i have no now understand anything basically anything so you if you are a very beginner and uh, you have to watch with the subtitles so that you can understand whatever they are saying their expressions their body languages and if you don't uh, you know like if you don't understand any words you can also uh, write them down in the book and later on you can search on the internet or you can search in any dictionary and try to understand their words so that you can use it you know whenever possible so this is a very plus point for us and all of this thing we consume on the internet like all of this information are in english and if you also add another level to it like watching movies and tv shows in english you will be uh, you know develop yourself you will boost yourself towards learning english very effectively maybe in just one month so if you do it if you practice it all of these things that i have said in this video like those three tips or practice yourself in the mirror speaking in english with yourself and try to correct yourself try to improve improve yourself with your errors with your mistakes and i'm sure you will learn it very fast less than a month maybe so make sure you try all of these tips that i have mentioned in the video and you can see yourself the differences that you have made the progress that you have made so from day 1 and from the day 30th you can see yourself improving improving every day and uh, yeah so i am also going to put some of the useful stuffs in the description box below alongside with those videos that i have mentioned earlier and so yeah thanks for watching and i hope you see yourself improving with english speaking with simple english speaking that i have you know with those tips that i have mentioned in this video so yeah i'll see you guys in the next video bye